Thursday morning, Bishop Ryan, staff and students. I'm here just to announce some class cancellations for today, so please listen up. Um, we have Miss Marino's period five class canceled. Miss Rochi's period one and period two classes canceled. Miss Tinteri's period three class canceled. Mr. Dentino's period one and period five classes canceled. Ms. Devsick's period two class canceled. All of Mr. Francis's classes are canceled for today. That's period one, period two, and period five for Mr. Francis. Ms. Borelli's period two and period three classes. All of Mr. DiPietro's classes, that's period one, period three, and period five. Again, all of Mr. DiPietro's classes. Mr. Cummings' period one class canceled. Mr. Hall's period three class canceled. And all of Ms. Halatic's classes are canceled. That's period one, period three, and period five for Ms. Halatic. So that's all for our class cancellations for today. If you have any questions or if you want to clarify any of this information, please see us in the office. Uh, in the meantime, have a great day. Don't forget to wear your uniform. Let's make today a productive day. Be safe and let's make some good decisions. And now. Hello, Bishop Ryan. I'm Daniel. And I'm Josh. And, here, and we're bringing you your morning announcements. Attention all art club members. Don't forget, we will be meeting today after school in the art room. The meeting will start at 3. See you there. Hey, graduates. Are you planning to pursue the, art, it, the arts in the post-secondary? If so, you're entitled to apply for the St. Thomas Center for the Arts Scholarship worth $1,000. Please see the guidance office for an application. Attention all staff, you need to submit a high school photo for our YEV Wayback segment. Any fun pictures of yourself on a sports team or event will be awesome. Send to WRBR 57.1 at Outlook.com or DM at WRBR News. Thank you so much. That's all from us and enjoy some more great announcements. Good morning, Bishop Ryan. Look at all those gorgeous faces on your TV, and mine was there too. Uh, my name is Mr. Pilo, and I'm representing the music program to let you know that there is no coincidence that you just saw footage from our last coffee house because there is another one happening tonight. This will be our third coffee house this year. There's been uh, a little bit of, uh, uh, well, to say that momentum has been taken away from our music program would be a giant understatement, but we've been trying to keep things going, uh, moving our coffee houses to the Timon Academy of Music for this year. And uh, you can see the details there up on your screen. April 29th, that would be tomorrow from 7 to 9 p.m. is the Coffee House. Now, this will be recorded and broadcast on our YouTube channel at a later date. So this is not live for you to watch tomorrow. There will be performers in the audience. We have a capacity of about 50 people up at Timon Academy. So uh, we are going to have a packed house there tomorrow. For all of the performers, make sure that you are ready. Make sure that your, your lyrics are memorized, okay? And if you need any last minute rehearsal, today would be the day to do it because we don't want to be, or today or tomorrow in the music room would be the day to do it because we don't want to be overwhelming Mr. Tabone up at Tabone Academy with last minute rehearsals uh, where uh, that just can't be done. So please make sure uh, that we are ready to go. I'm gonna ask all of our performers to be at Tabone Academy by 6.30 tomorrow evening, ready for showtime at seven o'clock. It is gonna be an amazing night. One more piece of news. I have so many students coming and asking, what is happening with the BR Expression, sir? Um, we've decided to hit the ground running, even though I'm not very good at running, uh, next year, full speed ahead. But there is something coming this year, and I'm very excited about it. Uh, I'm going to be bringing about 100 of us to sing the national anthem at the Hamilton Honey Badgers game on June the 2nd at 7 o'clock. Uh, honey Badgers are vicious. You ever seen them? Watch the Wild Crats. Check it out. But anyways, the Honey Badgers are a professional basketball team that plays out of what I still call Cops Coliseum, First Ontario Centre. 
Uh, and we are going to be on center court singing the national anthem, representing the musical B Army and the BC B Army, the Army of BR. See what I did there? Anyway, uh, June 2nd. All right, so keep your eyes peeled to the Instagram for details about that. Uh, and that's open for everybody, grade 9 through 12, anybody that wants to sing the national anthem at center court at a basketball game. Your friends and family can purchase tickets at a discounted rate. It's going to be a great time, June 2nd at 7 o'clock. I'm, uh, I'm dry, so I'm going to go drink some coffee and get back to my class because mine's not canceled. Have a great day, Bishop Ryan. Cheers. Hello again, Bishop Ryan, the, and here are your sports. The Boys Touch Football team competed at the annual Nelson Touch Football Tournament at McMaster University this past Tuesday. The squad comprised of many junior players who faced some ex experienced senior squads from Halton and were be able to compete competitive in every game. The boys are looking forward to competing in the Cody Championships later in May. Attention all boys interested in playing senior football this upcoming September. There will be a brief meeting after school today in room 229. If you are unable to attend, please see Mr. Davies in room 229 during periods 1, 2, or 5. The girls' touch football team competed at the Nelson Annual Touch Football Tournament yesterday at McMaster University. It was a frigid football day but the team preserved and improved with each game. The team is looking forward to the city champions later in May. All right, that's all from us. Have a great day. Have a day. great day. I'm a Good morning, BR. It's Ash from your BRSC here with a few important announcements. Starting off with some great news, ticket sales for BR's first official 2021-2022 school year formal start this Friday, April 29th, immediately after school. Tickets will be available to purchase on School Cash Online for $35. However, these ticket sales are limited, so get your tickets ASAP. The dance will be held this coming Wednesday, May 18th at Carmen's Banquet Center. We can't wait to see everyone there. In other news, due to the success of our first ever Just Dance Dance Off, we have another Just Dance Dance Off in the cafeteria this Friday, April 29th. So get your, moves, uh, get your best moves ready and we'll see you in the cafeteria on periods three and four lunches. That's going to be all from us today, Celtics. Have a great Thursday. Thanks.